Hi there. Uh, I'm just doing a video today on uh, my infill and redesign. Please join me and I'll say a few things as we go along but I'm going to concentrate so hard so please forgive me if I go quiet. Colors that I'll be using today is Birthday Suit from CJP and also uh, Crystal Glass from CJP and then uh, a glitter mix that I got from Glitter Addict. Taking a, a bead of uh, birthday suit and I'm putting it as close as I can to the cuticle and then I'm just working it down with the belly of my brush to the middle of the nail to form an apex and just drag it down because I will take another bead to just fill in the tip. I always take the tip of my brush to make it very smooth and um, flush with a natural nail once I've done the bead at the cuticle. Just making it smooth with the belly of my brush, shaping as we go along. Because you know what I like is it's smooth while I do the application, because then it gives me a little bit less file work to do at the end. There we go, thumb down. I'm just going to take a little bit of crystal glass, dip it into this multicolored glitter, do the tip of the nail so long. You'll see, I'll do, I'm just mixing it in and fading it out so that when this is dry, I can actually do. The encapsulation with crystal glass. And now, looking at that, I feel like just adding a little bit of holographic fine dust. Like that, that one. So what I'll do is I'll just take in that little bead, but a tiny bead, dip it into the holographic, just spread it wherever I feel the need and then just fade it to upwards then it gives it a little bit of a gradient with this uh, multicolored glitter and I find it quite appealing I'll move on to the next now 
sorry, I'm just going to turn, put down my bead, let gravity do its thing. That's why I'm tilting my nail downwards. Just draping it down as I go, making sure that I go right to the side of the nail. And you'll see. Just making sure that it's flush there. And the cuticle. Perfect. Just pushing with the belly of my brush to make sure that I get that nice arch. Like I said, I really don't feel like filing too much. Just putting at the tip, blending it upwards. Go, just making sure that I push it down with the belly of my brush and what I'll do with this one I'll just make sure that I put a bit of holographic at the tip Oh, sorry, I'm out of frame, concentrating so hard. You know what, you can always correct and add a little bit more if you've missed a little spot. Sorry, let me just get it there, here we go, done. So now we've got the thumb done, coarse one, fine one, we're going to do a mix of both again. Just turning my hand so that I can let this all run down close to the cuticle pushing with my brush flushing it down making sure that I've got a proper apex clean my brush into crystal glass, into multicolor glitter, putting it down, mixing it. I like just swirling my brush through it so that I know that I've got plenty acrylic sticking to the actual nail instead of, you know, maybe the glitter just getting stuck. I'm just like checking, making sure. And then pushing 
Let's dip a belly over the brush, dip a belly over the brush. And that's how I just go on. And like you guys know, it's not the easiest thing in the world to do your own nails. So yeah. stuck to my brush and I actually want it to stick there. There we go. So tiny little bit holographic. I just put it into the little spots, empty spots. There and then I just fade it in. Somebody at the gate again, and the dogs are barking crazy. So now I'm dipping my brush into the monomer, getting a nice big bead of a birthday suit. Um, let me just try and put it down like here. Working it up with the belly of my brush to the cuticle area, pushing down, pushing down so that it's flush with the cuticle, making sure that it's flush with the side walls. Here we go. Now you can see these are nice little bumps. So now I'm going to Push it down so that we've got a proper apex. I'll turn it so that you could see. And then what I'm doing is I'm pushing the front part down and dragging it with the belly of my brush. Then I can, I'm just going to add a little bit more because I see there is an opening there. This one I'm going to leave, leave birthday suit colour, the whole nail, because what are we going to do with this one is I think I'm going to put a multicolour little stone design on it there we go and let's see what the apex looks like and there we go the strength yeah You want it thin, thicker, and thinner. Another one birthday suit. Now we're going to go to the little finger. Clean on the side. I'll just 
put down another little bead of course I just want to strengthen the tip because it's so kind of thin See the arch. Still movable, you can keep on tapping and pushing with the belly of the brush. Done. So now we're just going to take a little bit of that. Mix again with a bead of, tiny bead of clear. Mix it. And working it up. Dipping it in a bit of glitter, it'll stick. Tiny little bead of uh, crystal glass and just fade. So, there we go. All I'm going to do now is encapsulate and then put on the Diamante or Swarovski crystal design and I'll get back to you soon. I'll put the revealing picture on. Thank you so much. Speak to you soon and thank you for watching. Bye.